What's going on guys? I want to make a real quick video here. Give my opinion on some things that are going on in the community. I don't know if you guys have ever heard the phrase you are or you associate with, but it definitely holds true and right now there's some people who I are forced to associate with that I don't exactly understand. You know, so we'll start off with Versus. You know, me and Versus have obviously had our spats. Obviously, the guy flagged a video down of mine that I can't upload anymore, tried to get my channel banned, just because I said some things about him that were true that he didn't necessarily like. So, for all that is righteous and holy that you try to portray, don't ever think that you fool me. For those of you who want to look at him as some type of video game martyr, I feel sorry for you. Because if he's the person, or any of us, or the person that you have to idolize in life is finding truth in something and being holier than thou, then I don't really want to know what's going on in your life that makes you have to do that. To Barney Fife, <laughs> you know, it's funny to me that you only get involved when it's popular to get involved. You, you didn't say anything about either game until Backbreaker came out, but then when it was popular and you could get some hits and some subs, you decided to go back after it you know you made this little clown ass video on a treadmill which i really could have cared less about the only thing i noticed is i thought it was awful odd you were winded after three minutes of brisk jogging and had to shut the shit off so you're not even really relevant to me to be honest with you but keep posting in my channel that you know i don't call it like it is and see it like it is or whatever the fuck you want to say i'm biased toward one game or another that's fine ronick <sighs> I thought you were a grown man, but I mean, I thought you had a kid and everything, but maybe, I don't know, maybe I was misled. Because when I see you in a chair laid back in a garage listening to the chronic and Tony Montana highlights with gunshot sounds in the background overlaid, talking about the calm before the storm and the warning shot, you better really seriously check yourself in life. If you really want to portray that type of person on YouTube, because I, I don't get the vibe that you're that type of person, man. You know what I'm saying? I really don't. People might want to make you look like that, but you're not. Finally, Mr. 360 Beast. You know, to me, you're more of a case study on this. I mean, you're young, and that's nothing on you. I mean, you can't help when you were born, but you were probably like 11 or 12 years old when the 2k Madden thing went down so you know you openly admit which is fine that you know Madden has been you know your nostalgia you know you've played this game this is the game you want to play and you can overlook the certain things and that's great and hey that's on you the problem is you know some of us that are older still play the games don't really look at it that way so if anybody you've got the most pure opinion of anybody coming straight up from just wanting to play Madden because it's what you grew up with. I can't hate you for that, but don't ever say to somebody else that they're biased when you really don't even have the full grasp of the situation. So in closing, to the people that watch these videos, this shit has just gotten out of control. You're watching characters, not information anymore. You know, it seems like you can either say everything positive about Backbreaker and be a fanboy and be hated and ridiculed for that and then have everybody say oh well you're just against EA because you used to bash Madden or you say one bad thing about Backbreaker and you know one good thing and people say well you're just bashing Backbreaker still we're never gonna get anywhere you know like this I mean we're just gonna be looked at as the gaming communities is more of a joke than we already are to be honest with you that's why I've always just tried to show the games for what they are put my opinion on it and let you decide whether you wanted to believe that or not. I don't need to make the same video 30 times to prove a point. I never did. Anybody who wants to see new videos for the next three weeks, go look at one you haven't watched in a while and look for something different. I don't know. But right now, the characters are overruling the message. And that's never a good thing. And it needs to pretty much get shut down. And I'm at fault for that. Everybody's at fault for that.